go. Opening day for these neighboring cities after this week. The next time these two could face each other down the road in June in the state tournament. Heartland won that exchange a year ago. Eagles advanced all the way to the Division I state finals for the first time in 23 seasons in 2018. Return one of the top pitchers in the state, sophomore Rachel Everett. First inning action, A.J. Militello down swinging. Howell returns their ace in the junior Molly Carney. Already committed to Notre Dame, she gets Devin Joe back for one of her seven Ks on the afternoon. Now the wind played a huge factor on Wednesday, gusts up to 30 miles an hour. Top of the second, Hartland a ribby runner on third. Miranda Millington, the fly ball to left and the stiff breeze helps it stay fair. Jordan Pytek comes in to give the Eagles a one nothing lead. Eagles get more in the third, runner on third. The senior Brooke Cowan crushes the pill deep and over the wall. The Davenport commit with a two run shot. Hartland now up three. I did not do very well at my first at bat, and so I just thought I'm gonna go up there. I'm not nervous, I'm excited. That's what I always tell myself, and I said I'm gonna get a hit, and I just swung hard and it went over. The 10th grader and total softball player of the year candidate Everett still dealing on the bump. Megan Keo caught looking. Everett threw eight Ks. But Howell would get the bats going in the fourth. The first team all stater and also a player of the year candidate, Militello to the wall in right. Stand up double. She'd later score. Highlanders trail three to one. Head to the bottom of the sixth. Howell once again knocking on the door with the pair on. Maddie Gillette pokes it to right. Keo crosses the dish. Highlanders only down a run. Couple batters later, Howell, bases loaded, one out. The sophomore Maddie Springer takes it to right, but Heartland sophomore outfielder Kelsa Campa laying out, quickly throws it in to keep the runner on third at bay. It was all or nothing. I knew I had to make the catch. Right when I saw it come off the bat, I just came charging and I gave everything I had. And I had a similar catch last year, so I was just, I saw it coming. I felt it coming before she even started hitting and I was just ready. Everett then gets Sky Grant to ground out to Cowan to end the threat. Hartland went into the final inning, leading 3-2. Eagles trying to add some insurance. Ducks on the pond for Delaney. Robeson, the grounder, scores one. Zampa tries to come in as well, but gunned out at the plate. Hartland up a pair. Everett closed it out, going the distance. Hartland hangs on to beat their rivals from Howell. 4-2 the final. Honestly feels unbelievable. It's so exciting for the whole team, especially the girls that are just, this is their first varsity game and we're just all so excited to be here.